Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. Four more levels left in the main game. I'm going to start with II once again and go to the Volcanic Pools. This is where the game starts getting genuinely difficult. So expect this video to be longer than the norm. <laughs> this is uh, why I decided to do one level per video, as I said, for organization's sake and for the fact that... Wow, lag. No, not the lag, but for the fact that as the levels get harder, it's, it's going to force me to do one level per thing. And, well, yeah, you get the idea. So I thought, eh... Let's just focus on the organization, it can't hurt after all. Whoa! <laughs> Needless to say, if you want to get up to those higher ones, you're going to have to jump or have a lot of speed on these slopes. Go down whoa, this hole and hold forward to get as much speed as you can, then jump when you get to the end. Ah, I like that. Delightful. And next stage, number two, here we go. Uh, there's a... It's basically a rail level with a couple of pyramids at the beginning, but it's basically a rail level, and this is a fairly tricky rail level, especially if you don't have these rails down packed. But uh, try and get through them as fast as you can without falling off the edge, because, you know, there's a time limit at all. Uh, this first one here, you need to have enough speed to bump over that edge, like that, without flying off into the lava. And, eh, good. Eh, very good. Uh, I think I'll be able to make it from here I hope do I want to go over or around I'm not sure because there's a ball <laughs> uh, oh dear oh my I'm not sure at all maybe I'll risk it please be gentle yes <laughs> I was worried that he was gonna bounce hard and go off the edge of my jump but I didn't want to deal with that ball Next one! This one is the holy stage. We have to fall down these Swiss cheese platforms of sorts. And you'll notice that some of these holes are too small to fall down like that one there, but you gotta look for the bigger ones to plop down like so. This is obviously harder depending on the character size that you have, so Gong Gong will have to find the largest holes while I, I is comfortable with ones like that. And there's the goal inside Ye Ol Funnel. Woo! Next one, number four. Oh, this one. This one is based on pure consistency in control. This one might take me a couple tries. And what is with that lag when I start stages? That's really weird. See, because it's it's a downhill slope, but you have 120 seconds to do this. So you have to go fairly quick. So, yeah, you'll see what I mean once I get to the next section. Uh, you could take a shortcut and jump down there where that uh, dinosaur mouth was. Well, fossil mouth, right here, if you wanted to. But here is where things get tricky, and where you want to keep as much control as you possibly can. I like staying on the outer edge because it's, you know, wider. Well, it, not wider, it's, I mean, it, you can go, like, have a little bit of leeway with your speed and whatnot as opposed to the inner edge, which can very well... Uh, you can go a little too tight, and here's where it gets even tighter, so that means you even need more control. And I seem to be doing fairly well here. Surprisingly, wow. Maybe you don't have to go as fast as I was going. <laughs> I am impressed. I'm surprised I did that well, really. No! Why? Why must you do this to me? I didn't do anything to anyone. I never hurt anyone. Why? Why do I have to be put through this? Please, just end. 30 bananas left, and I believe I'm going to have to jump from bone to bone on this last one, so I'll probably be unsuccessful, but that's okay. I can live with that. Okay. <laughs> I don't really care all that much. I'm doing surprisingly well on volcanic pools here. Number five starts. Um, I believe this is the turning platforms one. Mm, yes, it is. You can either just like jump across the gaps like that or use the platforms to roll across however you feel like it. So you have options in this one. It's not that hard of a stage. I just lost control there. <laughs> Alright, attempt two. I'm just gonna do this again. Yeah, see, it's not that hard to control as long as you use your jumps 
as good as you can. And what I'm gonna attempt doing is roll a crow. Maybe it's harder than I remember. I don't know. <laughs> I think it's because I just didn't have the camera set up in the right spot. So I was jumping at an angle, and it's kind of uncomfortable to do that. My fault. Yeah, I'm just gonna skip this one. Who cares? <laughs> And you'll notice that they're set up, like see how, how they're slightly uh, angled differently so you can roll across them like that. Um, otherwise you might fall to the level of death! Oh dear! Oh my! Ooh, ee, okay. <laughs> yeah, I know I'm turned around, I just have to get the camera like so. Alright, go 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 go! Last one I think, no wait there's one more after this. Oh, and there's a 3Z here. Yeah, this one isn't too hard. Oh, the time. That's why I remember this one. <laughs> yeah, that's why I remember it. remember it being slightly more difficult than it seems, because you have to rush through the freaking stage. Yeah, I was just a little bit behind there. Oh, okay, gotta pick up the pace now. Okay, maybe this one is slightly harder than I remember. It's it's the thing of that it's easy to get across the platforms, but you must do it consistently, and you must do it quickly as well. So I'm not going to dilly belt me. <laughs> At least with on like on the first couple ones, just to try and get some uh, leeway and time. Because I'd really rather not wait for them to turn around if at all possible. <clears throat> Like, something like that is ideal for saving time. Yeah, good. A little thinner. And that should be fine there. Good. I'm gonna wait for it to go around again, even though I said it's not ideal. But I just don't feel comfortable at that point in time. I wasn't mentally ready for the trials that awaited me there. Good. And here's the last. Go, 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 yes, and I have plenty of time this time, so I can afford to do it, let me be a little more careful here. Voila! It just goes to show that as long as you keep trying, you can beat anything. Number six, start! Wait, what was this one? Is this another rail level? I think it is. Hmm. With stairs, which is clearly the greatest obstacle. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go up the middle. Oh, I can't even fit on the side ones. <laughs> Just fall right through them. So I'm gonna have to take the thinner middle one here. Oh, I didn't mean, did not mean to do that. It's okay, I, I. Just hop yourself up there gently. There we go. Yeah, I think the larger ones are for if you have a larger character. So I guess that's where the advantage of using a character like Gangan Gan would come from. Now over here, you want to transfer to go down there, and then go through here, transfer again to that platform, and which one? The middle one. Eh, eh. I know, I know, I know, stop getting stuck, I, I. Uh-oh. Can I, like, get it? Oh, okay, there we go. Uh, uh, okay. <laughs> I was a little worried there that I would keep getting stuck and I wouldn't have been able to make it. But I did, and it's okay. Um, now it's another spiral type level, except this one's spinning. Um, I forgot how you're supposed to do this one, actually. Like, it's not hard to get up to the top. The issue is getting yourself to jump towards the goal, which is on the center pillar there. I believe what I want to do is keep the camera as straight as possible like this, so I can re-angle myself to get over there because I know on this stage you can flip the camera around accidentally which is pretty much a death sentence on this level because the way it's set up okay we're getting near the top there we go that's not that hard I guess just gotta keep the camera straight as I showed the last one I believe is a speedy sprint type of level this one's pretty fun I have to say you have 60 seconds so seems like you have a lot of time but it's laggy again at the beginning why does it keep doing that Woo! Don't waste time. Just go, 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 and jump off the... Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, I, I'm screwed, aren't I? Yeah, I'm just gonna plop myself off there. <laughs> I believe you have to jump off the boosters there to get as much speed as you possibly can to get over them altogether. 
And then there is a... No, wait, jumping actually seems like it's worse. Yeah, don't jump. <laughs> and woo! Freaking no! No, no, no! Woo. Yeah, I don't think you can get out of here once you get in there. Maybe you can? Nah. <laughs> but after that, you see that loop around? That is an entire track full of those boosters. And why does it lag so much when you start the level? That is super weird. <laughs> Alright, max speed. Made it that time. Now, how fast do I want to go here? Not that fast, apparently. <laughs> That's another thing, is that you have to control your speed as you're going around, but you still have to go fast enough to beat the time limit. Alright, laggy beginning. I have faith that- wow, I really flew that time. <laughs> what, what makes you get so much speed off those things sometimes, while other times you don't? I, I have no idea. Maybe it's the, how direct you hit these things. Alright, this looks like a good pace. I can just use the edge as a guide. This seems lovely. Alright, I think I've got it this time. I think I have to jump, though. Yeah! I failed miserably. <laughs> Curses! I'll get it eventually. As I said, you just gotta keep trying. I very, very w unlikely will be able to beat this level 7 without a continue to get Z-Gold Crown, but really, as the viewer, you will have to learn all these stages and the feel of them yourself anyway. I'm just showing you the best way how to get through them as I go, even if it takes me a few tries, so... In a way, this walkthrough isn't all that helpful. <laughs> in, that, in the fact that you have to really, really work hard on some of these stages to get the consistency down. Alright, looking good. Looking very good. It's like a, like a figure eight spine of sorts. Okay, final boost section for the freaking win! Yeah! Woo! And boss stage! I again forgot what the heck the boss is. Wow. Oh, this one! I remember it now. All those balls that are on that thing, once you hit him, they scatter around the playing field, and they are incredibly annoying. And he's gonna attempt to knock you off the field like that, and you gotta try and dodge it. I kind of forgot how to dodge it. <laughs> warning, 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 go, go, go. Must play again. Must continue. How do I want to dodge you, anyway? You are going to slam, and then, what do I do to get up there? Oh, he just falls down to the ground, and then I gotta find him and hit him. Uh, 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 almost hit him. Come on, come on, come on. No, <laughs> that was my own fault. Well, it's the first time I've used to continue this walkthrough. I knew it was coming eventually. And that's what the boss stage icon looks like, if you didn't see that before on the stage select screen, so you can select it any time after you unlock and beat the stage. Alright, bring it on, monkey man. Bring it on. I guess when they turn- wow. I guess when they turn gray, they, like, fly everywhere, they detach from each other. Wow, if that one hit me, that would have been catastrophe. And whoa, 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 don't touch me, don't touch me while you're reforming there, that might knock me off. Uh, do I have to do this like five times? That seems a little excessive if you ask me. Uh, this attack really isn't all that bad as long as you keep moving to one side. You can even go underneath him if you want to. <laughs> yeah, I guess you can just like roll right into him. Can I hit him again? Can I hit him again? No, I guess I can't hit him again. Hmm. I guess I'm gonna have to wait for each cycle, but I will try to hit him each time, and I'm f far enough away that I won't even be touched by him this time. Okay, maybe this isn't that bad, I just had to get the hang of it again. And touch, 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 don't, there we go. And I'm gonna let them reform, because they all move towards the same center area. What is this? Oh my god, 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 what is this? Oh, it actually doesn't do that much to me, I see. Hmm. Well, I guess it threw me off for a second there, but it wasn't all that deadly. <laughs> Where is... oh. He's on that ball. No, no, let me hit. There we go. 
get off to the edge and don't let the balls touch you so they don't knock you off the edge. Good. He's going to be doing this again. Yeah, this is a, it's a lot easier. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> it looks like he got a little more aggressive there to try and boot me off with his spike balls. And... Uh, whoa! Whoa, no! No! <laughs> that was almost a catastrophe. Must... Oh, hurry up. I must get over to... I got him! Yeah! And he just died in midair. Oh, no, he's on the platform. Didn't see that. <laughs> Bad camera angle. And that's the end of World 5. Congratulate yourself. Like so. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this part, and I will see you in the next part. You are probably tired of seeing me enter my name, as well as the credits, so I'm just going to see what the poop place will actually... Oh, you're probably... Oh, I didn't get any place. That's perfect. I don't have to enter anything. Okay, see you later.